How's it going? So today what we're going to be doing is I got some more um, black spray paint cans. We're going to be putting down some of that matte um, spray paint. I've probably got 90 minutes to get some work done today. Um, I've got to get all the fairings, so all the, the new side fairings and um, all the parts I took off last time, all sprayed with a base coat. So here's the Vespa AT4 I'm working on at the moment. I stripped it down today and gave it a hose in the back garden. I've decided I'm going to could do a completely blacked out model. And while I was cleaning it off with the hose, uh, some of the paint started coming out, some of the parts. So here's the glove box. So I decided to strip it all down. So I'm just in the middle of stripping it down now. But here's all the different parts. I've ordered some more parts today. All in, I've spent about uh, $200, $220 on different bits and pieces um, to fix up this. Uh, the work I've already done, I've already worked on the exhaust. Used a um, standard kind of barbecue. Is it Rust Oleum or something for barbecues? Is that it? No, automotive base coat. There we go. Ace heat resistant paint for, for barbecues. I think what you're supposed to do is start up the bike, let it get up to temperature, and then spray it on. So before that I had I had already got rid of all the rust off it by got a wire brush to it. And then I sprayed it. So I did that a few weeks ago. And today I just cleaned it off. I've ordered a couple of nuts, a new lot, uh, nuts and washers for fixing on the um, heat plate. What else? I've also done some work on this panel. So this was dented in um, and had a couple of, it already had some dents actually when I bought it. So it had a big dent here, a new one and a couple of scratches here. And I'll put some screenshots on, but uh, basically I used some Bondo, uh, smoothed all that out and sprayed it. One of the things I've noticed since I've sprayed it, um, I've been using aerosol cans, I don't have a, a spray gun, is that it was great for the color, but when I put the glass finish on, it's kind of finished in this kind of, um, it's got all these little fine dots. It feels nice, it's kind of a matte finish, but it's different from the original uh, body paint. So what I'm gonna be doing next is, I'm going to spray the whole bike with that same glass. Um, to make this this dark version. I'm also planning on taking the rims off, taking the wheels off and giving them a black um, color as well so that the bike will be fully blacked out except for a couple of chrome mirrors. So it should be nice. And that's what I'm going to be talking through for the next couple of videos. <laughs> What did I do last? So last weekend I put down the first coat of primer all over the bike. I decided that I was going to do it the lazy way to start and just keep all the components in place but I was worried then about um, dripping and just not doing a proper job of it. So since then I've kind of, I've taken everything off. Uh, let's see if I can see it here. I've taken all the parts off and I've been spraying them individually. I do have all these components over here as well. So I did get um, order some side, some of the side fairing bits. I've taken all the indicators off and cleaned them. So all of these need spray painting. <laughs> So what did I get done today? Um, a fair bit. I got um, I got the second coat uh, of uh, spray done throughout the bike. I'm reasonably happy with it. A little bit of spitting went on when I was doing the the kind of um, 
the glove box, the, the kind of the leg shield from the glove box. So I've got a couple of um, um, burnt through areas where I, I probably had the spray can too tight. It started raining during part of my primer bit, which is classic. So I got rain on it just after I'd sprayed the primer on some of those. So we'll see how they come out. All in all, given that it's just a, a spray can job, I'm pretty happy with it. I'm gonna to have to get some 1500 grit uh, sandpaper going before the final coat, just to get off some of the little kind of um, pitting that's going on with the paintwork. But I have to say, I'm, I'm really happy with the paint so far. Um, yeah, a couple of more cans and we should be okay. Anyway, um, not sure what else I've got time for today. I did really wanna take the rims off. I bought some, um, some paint, uh, I bought some paint and glass for the rims basically. So uh, I wanna get that done. But besides that, we're in good shape.